All right, we are here with head coach Paul Wojciechowski and pitcher Doug Van Dyke from Dubuque after their 8-3 to win over Bethany Lutheran in an elimination game here at the Duluth Regional. Coach, just talk a little bit about your team's performance today and what you liked about what they did. Uh, great, hey, great day for the Spartans today uh, to uh, <clears throat> accomplish another first get our first NCAA win in school history. It was outstanding. Uh, what a performance by the big guy on my left. He did a complete game. Uh, first one of the year. Really uh, uh, the game we needed out of the day. So props to Doug. He scattered a few hits around, but uh, only gave up three runs. So nice job. And then uh, up and down our lineup, everybody in our starting lineup had a base hit. I think all the two of them had multiple hits. So. Uh, just a great day of the performance here. Uh, we're excited to stick around the loop for another day or more. Doug, obviously you probably came into this knowing that they're a big hitting team. What were you able to do to kind of minimize that from kind of taking over today? Uh, just really mixing up pitches. Uh, first time through the order, starting them off with kind of like balls with a few breakers. And then throughout the game, we just started mixing it more and more. Really keeping them off balance. Okay. Coach, can you talk about how important it is to have someone come up with a complete game performance on day two, knowing that you might have to use a lot of pitchers to stick around? Yeah, great question. Uh, you know, that's that's the coaching staff we talked about that we were hoping Doug could go deep in the game. We got to the seventh inning and we tacked on a, a run there and got us a five-run lead. That's like, okay, hey, let's just let's see how this plays out. But let's let him finish it. Uh, and so, like everybody else in the tournament, once you get the loser's bracket, you know, there's a few more innings you have to pitch to. So, just uh, that adds to the level of his performance today. Just a great job of keeping him on now. Doug, how did it feel to get that late run and then another late run to kind of give you that cushion? It really helped me settle in even more. Just that a couple extra runs just made me more comfortable out there. You Knowing I was pitching with the lead just made, me, made it a lot better. What do you think, uh, Doug and Coach, for your, this being your first regional, getting that win? What do you, what does that say about your program? What, who might not know a lot about the Butte baseball? Well, well again, I, I think uh, you know a couple of things. It goes along back to the you know, regular season title, the first one in 68 years, uh, the first conference tournament title in school history, and then now this year. You know, more than anything, what it does, it just validates. You know, all the hard work that the players have put in, uh, the coaches, previous assistant coaches I've had. And uh, our school, our administration, has just really done a phenomenal job of getting behind our athletic department, including baseball. And we've got some great boosters uh, that have chipped in as well. And, uh, you know, it's just, it, it's, it's really important for us to take that next step. And, uh, you know, we're excited to, you know, see where it takes us this year and then moving forward in the future. Doug, what do you think you can take into tomorrow's game from today to be able to build on this win? Just keep going out and playing our game. That's all we can do. Keep playing. Can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else, guys? I'm good. Thank you. Congratulations and good luck tomorrow. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks, guys.